Oh, 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 man, I'm oh, trying to get them trees that submerged down there by what? What you say, low by 15 feet? What up, YouTube? It's your boy, Yarbo, aka Django 3000 with DB Crap Fishing and Outdoors. Back here again with my ace in the pocket. Tell them who y'all are. Hello? What's up, YouTube? Hey, man, what we finna get ready to do, bro? We're gonna go out here and cook this work in for y'all, man. I'm talking about showing up. See, these big girls still out here doing what they do. Do you have that feeling today, man? I really do. Man, you know you my, uh, Feeling kind of good. You man. my antenna, man. My, my fish catching antenna. How do you feel today? Just tell the folks what your aspirations are according to how you feel about fishing day on what you got to do. I feel like the bite gonna be on, but the place we going, I don't know what the size gonna be. Why you don't think so? Because, you know, you know where we going. Man. It ain't never did no, no no size like that before. Mine, but I feel like the bite gonna be on. But we actually going a, a different way than the, the way we normally be going. So maybe the big bug up hanging up river, upstream, up lake, whatever you wanna call it. Hey man, before we start, I man, I wanna give you a pound. For adhering to that COVID-19 regulation, man. You covered up pretty good, bro. That's right, man. You know, real good, real good. Taking these fish, actually, these are people used to go fishing with, man. So I'm just taking stuff that I already got, man, and using it for something else. That's right, man. You know, we're allowed to go out here and continue to fish, man, so you might as well do it safely. Ain't that right, home skiller? That's right. That's right. But we headed back out Lake Oconee. Uh, we going on that Richland Creek side of the lake tonight. And we going to do as my homeboy say, put that work in. We're going to tight line fish with what, bro? These minnows, but we get out there kind of early, so we probably going to set up on top of some trees and try a little jig and that, because we, we real early today. We got, we got about another hour and a half with the sun left, so might be jig assessing. Well, I made a promise. Yeah, you did that. I got to limit out and then call them out with some of them famous semi right game day jigs and fly. That's right. Support my homeboy. He said, put them things to work, Jane Go. They already tried and true, but you know what, man? I'm going to get footage of me slabbing out with a couple of those uh, them awesome jigs he make, man. So, with that being said, nothing new about what we're doing tonight. Right, homie? Nighttime tight line. Nighttime tight line. So what we gonna do is we're gonna go out there, we're gonna catch them, we're gonna put them in a box, we're gonna show you guys some great footage, and we're gonna give you a good a good little bit of live scoping, right? Alright. We're gonna show you guys what we set up on man and how the fish are behaving. You know, just give you an idea of where our minds were prior to going out there. Cause you know, if you guys follow the Thursday night live, we always go out there with a strategy that right home work. Every time. Every we'll, time. We'll just go out there just to be going and figure out when we get out there. We already have the game plan in mind. And we go out there and try to set that game plan into motion. That's right. That's why we ain't, that's why we never had to fit the same spot. That's right. We make our spot. That's right, you two. With that being said, man, thanks for supporting the channel. If you guys like this content, man, listen here. Give us a like, share the video, and definitely if it's your first time visiting the channel. Hit that subscribe button, man. We're gonna greatly appreciate that thing, man. And uh, as we always say, hang in there, man. We're gonna bring you guys some great footage, man. That being said, take us out, bro. Look this says, Jungle 3000. We got Adrian behind us and the almighty swing. <laughs> that being said, we out of here, Pete. Here we go. How about I was just recording the same thing and it didn't even have the button pressed, so I didn't even get that first footage. But we're fishing over structure, a uh, grove of trees. The tips of those trees are about 10, 15 feet below the water. As you can see, zero being the transducer right here. That's where we are. We are right above a bunch of lay down trees that covered with, with crappy. And all around, if you can see from, from zero to 45 feet, the same tight structure under the water. That's what we're fishing tonight. 
doesn't seem like many fish on the screen, but they are there. And when we turn these lights on, should be phenomenal tonight. I got with me today, Ace in the pocket, Lope. Tell him what's up, homie. You too. Hawk. That my boy Hawk over there, you guys can see him. What's up, bro? What's up, that Django? That's it. Hello. Over here, we got the eye. Tell him what's up, eye. There you go. So we're gonna make this thing happen, y'all. So uh y'all hanging out with me, man. My boys out. In the side, man. Yeah, that's a nice one. Hold on up to the camera. Got to be a white bed, though. Woo, that's a grown man. Give me that nick. Woo, that's a grown man. You know what? He really ain't a grown man by been catching so many damn small fish. Hey, Hercules, you know, bro. He ain't about 13 inches. You really had to get a net for that last fish. Look here, man. You ain't been stuck. Homie, you better give me some praise on that damn fish. You know what, man? You a hater, man. You a what you call a crappy hater. <laughs> you want to shot the hell with that look that with the look of the thing right here? Oh, I was just saying this joker here tripping. <laughs> I just told you, hey, look, look, look. Hey, hey, you know you catch so many small fish. You just catch a regular a one that you supposed to keep. <laughs> and you think he'll haul, you know what I mean? Woo, he he you like, you know, you think you finna say 15 inches. Boy, he 12 inches. <laughs> Boy, he 12 inches, low. And then he swallowed the hook. Right there, you two. Finally caught a keeper fish. Boy, I'm struggling tonight. <laughs> but it's going to be all right, man, because I got fish in the freezer. There's an expedition tool here. We're going to make it do what it do. Y'all hanging out with me. Crap it up. Oh, I got one on. One on. Where did slack come from? What come from that dog on? Oh, he got me. Let me see. Oh, you trying to start them up, huh? Hey man, I got no light back here, man. What you mean? You trying, to, you trying, to, you trying to not let you two see that? Well, the light ain't on, matter. No, I turned to the side. Hold up. There you go, homie. Huh, you got a Dexter. Yeah, Dexter, man. Well, what Dexter mean? That's a new one for you. I named all the flags. All the what? All the flags.
It should have jumped off that other batter, man. Damn, I got one on. Yeah, I got one on. Ooh, I got I call you back. Damn, he nice too. Ah, come on in. Come on. Nice crap. You know what, man? This joke ain't even 10 inches, I don't think. What it did right here? Is that 10 inches? That probably 11 inch fit, man. I'm just sitting here just. Big Ben got me. Everything look little. Chris, yeah. don't nothing impress me now, man. I caught them big old slabs, man. I can't look at that. That's a nice fish, man. And I can't even. I don't even like it, man, because I done caught something better. And then my Bob here, man, he ain't giving me no. Well, he ain't getting these fish no respect, man. That's a nice fish, you two. We gonna keep them all day long. I don't care what a sass say. That's a good fish, sass. Sass like, yo, what up? Hey man, say whatever make you sleep at night. <laughs> say whatever, he said, if I like it, he look. It's a nice one. Good. Well. Nothing to this one. About a 10 inch fit. Leave now, I'm going to put him in the box. I don't even know if I want to even clean him, but. Well, they get much better. Ooh, that's a grown man right now. Now you talk crap. Let me see. Let me see her, folks. Let me see her, folks. 
he popped that jig. Look at that right there. Oh, he popped it. He on that. <laughs> there you go. I just changed it out. I went with a blue. Blue shag. He here. I went a double blue shag. Can you guys see that? With the swim tail on it. He popped it. I didn't even jig it. Went out. Ooh, come on now. Dick. And uh Dive all right there in it, cause he squalled this thing. I'm doing a little surgery on you, boy. There we go. Nice little, little fish. You had some toughies too. Oh, okay. Look at that. Ooh, stuck it. Don't you come off. That feel like cat. Oh. You my friend, man. Second, how the hell he keep coming out this damn pole? Quit don't tell nobody, man. For real, man. I'm gonna tell nobody I'm out here sucking, man. Jay goes back to having problems. And Lucas instead of catching the Ooh, these, these man, things, you got man. a grown man. Look here, man. We gonna lie on the next one, okay? Next lie we going. You gonna lie. Oh, that's a nice fish. Please don't be no striped. Please stripe. That's a, that's a crap. That's a nice crap there, you too. Putting that work in now. I done got that super sky out my way. Now I can put in my work. I'll be so busy concentrating on him, trying to make sure he have a good, now I can't concentrate on my own fishing. Now, you know, he let it out with my help, so I, uh, I can fish with some peace now. I got a fish on I don't call no name. Gotcha. Stuck that pig. God, he running on the motor. Get through that one back out there. He's going in his box, huh? Young man, uh, you too. Sure. All right, that's what we're sitting on top of. Got a nice tree. Bait fishing moved in. Fish are holding down, I believe it or not, about 20 feet deep. The big ones, but we're trying to get them to do something, man. We're getting hit by a lot of those around that 15 foot range. They, they range from about 11, 12 inch fish. We're looking for a little bigger than that. So we're gonna hold out here till the bite comes in. Hopefully that's pretty soon. So y'all hanging out with us, man. Hey man, you soon you come on a boat, here you go with that boy. And you got a man. Ooh, ooh that's striped that one. Ooh, look at that crap. Here, man, hold on, hold on, hold on. Put a net. Put it. I, I got it right here. Ooh. I mean, he all right. <laughs> man, he all that. Yeah. Man, get this. Huh? Wish you did. Man, that joke finna start hanging so bad. Check it out, man. Y'all vote with this sis. Hold that joke up, man. Hey, go on, give me that commentary, man. On that one right there.
Chris said, what happened, man? <laughs> <laughs> God, <right? laughs> so let me tell y'all what just happened, right? <sighs> I was done for the night. <laughs> but my man, 50 grand, Mr. Chris over there decided, hey, look, you get a couple more men over. I turned him down at first, which I really wanted some. You know, I'm trying to be nice. <laughs> I said, no, nah, at first, but I really wanted some. And, uh, I just got two poles in the water. I turned my back, and they had that 14 for the end of the water. You know me, I'm thinking maybe with those sky, uh, fry my heart. Gonna find out. It was old Jake. <laughs> State Farm. <phone. laughs> that tried and true. <laughs> There's no Jake from State Farm, y'all. You know. And I was finna, you know, I was gonna lie to me in. You know, they pull them up. Mr. Yarvis said, Oh look. Uh, Get dang, the what? net. What up, Get the pounds? net. We God, dang. So we got we got three people to thank for this. My boy Chris. Y'all vote in the sass. Everybody put a little work in on it. <laughs> so we all chipped on that one. Everybody put work in I to make this happen. I got five on it. <laughs> What's up, YouTube? Facebook, IG. About that time again, man. Uh, we just came out here. Richland Creek. Reynolds Lake. Put in on some fish, man. Uh came here uh, checking out a spot we scouted out earlier this uh this season we decided let's go back and check it out for nighttime crappy fishing man and uh lo and behold we found another load of fish man not quite the fish we were looking for but fish nevertheless and uh i think we did to do man what you think about that homeboy come over in the light man so they can get you get a picture of you man get your covid mask on man what you do that homeboy I caught fish. Like I said, they went in size, which I already told y'all before we came up. I told we were gonna catch the fish. But for some reason, this part of the lake don't produce the size like- Hey man, you you in the dark, man. Come on, so folks can see. There you go. Don't Just produce the size of fish like down, back down that way. So we caught fish. I threw back, I threw back a limit plus on. Yeah. I, I, caught some, I caught some nice little slabs, some nice slabs. Yeah, but uh, uh, nice mess of fish. You started out, they were real small. Yeah, I, I was making so them real mad. So, we, we changed position, we went to a different part of the lake, right? right. Uh, we were still catching a lot of fish, right? They were just one quality. Right. So we went back to a, to a spot lower down the, uh, the creek, and uh, you found them, right? I mean, they-, they Did they come in like you thought they were gonna come in? Yeah, yeah, the fish, but not the size. Man, like, but you caught some big fish, I man. I know, but I was throwing, I had got so mad and frustrated, I was throwing away love me fish, man, because they ain't what I wanted to see. Yeah, but you caught some grown men now. Yeah, they, I caught some nice Yeah, man, so uh, let's do what we normally do this time time of the night. What we, what we do, homeboy? Oh, That's right. Man, uh, i going to show you guys the box, man. Uh, I went down, man, and uh, everything was slow for me, but I actually limited it out. As you can see, I still had my boat set up for long line trolling uh, off the front. Normally, I fish in a, a spider rig array off the front. Lo tried to tell me to go ahead and do it, but I was running for time, so I, so I did what I did. Oh, yeah, by the way, y'all, y'all say what's up to the homie. What's Tell them who you are. You too. What's up? I'm Chris, man. I'm, I'm living in Hampton, but I'm from Macon. Hey, man, it's good to be out here with them boys. You know? <laughs> How you do tonight, man? Hey, man, I didn't catch but like six, but these boys <laughs> showed out on me, man. But no, that's okay. man. I'll be back, though. I'll be back. Definitely, man. You're going to come back with no us, bro. Doubt. No doubt. Y'all heard it, right? No doubt. But hey, man. Hey. Like I told you on that water, it's about what? Hey man, it's about that fellowship. That's what you know? I'm trying to tell it's you, about man. That fellowship, you know, we ain't out there doing no drugs. We out here just trying to catch this fish, you know, fellowship. Tell you, it's a whole lot worse. Grown men can be doing this time of night. No but what we out here doing, hey, bro? Fish. We putting it together, man. We putting them in the box, man. That's it. And uh, 
with nothing else left to do, we'll show you the box. There we go. Now y'all see that grotesque tail sticking out there? That's my boy Lope. That's 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 his last and final joke to me. Say, hey man, I saved you son. <laughs> I don't know if the fish is sky or if he is sky. But as you guys can see, we limited it out, man. I mean, we had a hundred minnows I use. I use almost every last one of them, man. So if I do the averages, throwbacks and the ones I kept, I know I'm at a good, good limit. Y'all see how big my cool is. It's filled to the brim. Number crappy, just not the size that I want. I think they average anywhere from about 11 to 12 inch crappy. But uh, that still ain't bad, man, right? That ain't bad. Low leaving these sardines on the dick for me. I'ma take them. <laughs> I'ma take them. For the simple fact, it's ha ha joke joke on on on, on Django tonight. No, man. no, it's not. No, it's yeah, not, it is. You kept, you kept, you kept, no, I kept, I kept, I kept, I kept, Y'all hear that? <laughs> now we DB crap, uh, DB white bad fishing outdoor. Let's see that box on, but I know you proud, ain't you? Hey, man, before we even go over there, man. Just folk know, so they know. We don't want to call it. Listen here, man. All day, every day. We throw that thing out there, we talk junk, but in the end, man, it's teamwork. Team DB. Team DB, and we put it in. Let's see that box, homie. I know you proud of it, because I seen some of them skies you pulled out of there. Oh, man. You all right, though, homeboy? That's what you want. Man, somebody throw a light on that. Y'all got a light. There you go. Throw that light in, man. Take it off. There you go. Do y'all see them skies? There you go. Look at them. Look at them cracking. My homeboy went out there, and that's no ice. He went out there and laid that smack down on their ignorant woods, man. And uh, actually need to take a couple of measurements on it, because he's looking for a 17 inch, man. And I think he's close. Like 16, what, the 16, 15? He caught a 16 inch? Which one is 16? This boy right there. That one right there on top? That's a 16 inch crappy on top, y'all. And that's the 15. And the next one right beside, that's a 15 inch, man. Hey, man, you know, you never know what you're gonna catch when you come out here. But, when you put that work in, and uh, <laughs> you plan ahead, you get close to what you're looking for in that right home, boy. Like I say, man, you know, part of putting that work in is doing your homework before you get there, man, and uh, it pays off in the end. With that being said, homeboy, you wanna take us out? Hey, hey. Come on over here, come on over here in the light so they can see. Hey, once hey. again, I'm a newbie. Hey, it's good to meet these guys, fellowship with DB, with DB Crappy. Hey, man, these are some good boys. Them boys. <laughs> That's right, them boys. And Luke, I gotta get it to you, man. You put that work in. Django, you put that work in too. I'm sorry I came in last, but hey, I'll be back. <laughs> I'll be back. That being hey. said, you guys, we out of here. Peace. Peace.